All right, folks, here for an OU battle today versus Raymond. Finally using freaking Serral Edge. Love this mod. I had it in my playthrough. It was a very key star towards the end of my uh, playthrough run. What are we going to do? Should we just lead off of Chomp? They've got the infamous Tinglu fissuring everyone in VGC. I tried to use it with um, just, you know, nice whirlwind ruination set. No f toxic fish or anything like that. I think I'm fine with leading off with it. I tried to build a team, I literally had like four out of five of the same mons here, and then I tried to rebuild the team around Serral Edge, and then I just kind of built the same team. <laughs> I don't know what to tell you. But I wanted to use Serral Edge, because I don't think I've used it yet, and if I did, then I didn't do anything. So, I gotta use it. Because I'm pretty sure I use Armor Rouge, right? At the very least, I use Armor Rouge in VGC. You know that for sure. I might have to try expanding force here in um, OU2 now that it didn't. I think it moved. Uh, Armor Rouge is OU for sure. I think indeed he might be OU. They did lead off of the Iron Valiant. This kind of sucks because now I can't get on my hazards. I feel like this thing is. Yeah, this thing just kind of wrecks my team, honestly. It's quite unfortunate for me. I might just have to sack myself off here and accept fate. I don't want to waste my Terra. Because I literally can't switch anything into this. But I don't want to play a game. Who can I sack off? Who don't I need? I can't sack off anybody, unfortunately. Seems as though I'm resigned to dying on turn one. Quite unfortunate. I built a team mono weak to Iron Valiant. Maybe I live. Nope, absolutely not. Quite unfortunate for me. I was Ubers and now I'm not. It's okay. So, um. Should we just SD? Try to get something going. They're gonna go out into their frickin' other mon. I could also try to booster versus them. Man, I'm just gonna lose to Don Dozo too. I don't know what to tell you. Folks, it's not looking good for your boy because now they're just going to go Amoongus. Really, I've already lost this battle on team matchup because I've been playing all lower tiers and I have not built OU in quite a long time. I'm sorry to say that this is over and uh, we'll see you guys in the next Wi-Fi battle. I've literally already used up my booster energy. I know that they're just going to go into their freaking Amoongus and then they're going to spore me. Quite unfortunate there. Here comes the Amoongus folks that I can do absolutely nothing versus it. I calm minded for no reason other than the fact. Yep, digging myself further into debt here. But I just didn't want to waste my booster. My booster's now wasted, I'm afraid. And uh, gonna have to go on a Tiger Star. Absolute waste of my team whole team just gets walled or wrecked. I built an absolutely garbaggio team How to not build a team in five minutes um, Let's at least try to get something out of this turn. Let's go for knockoff. I don't know how I'm going to win this versus a freaking Don Dozo with Unaware. I mean, I do have Flower Trick, which is nice. So we'll knock off whatever item this thing has. We'll get rid of the lefties at least. We can go on a spin cycle. Maybe I could have also gone out to my um, other guy. Yeah, I don't know how I'm going to beat a Moongus. I mean, obviously I have the Serral Edge, but still. I'm just go for a Will-O-Wisp. Like, I honestly should have let off of this instead of Garchomp, looking back at it. I was thinking, oh, they have an Iron Valley that could wreck me. I'm like, they wouldn't let off with it, but they did, unfortunately. It's quite unfortunate. So I can Volt Switch here to get a little bit more chip.
back out of this thing. There's no freaking special attack grass types anywhere. Go for a foul play, does nothing to me, that's cool. Try to U-turn here. Yep, they did stay in. Well, at least we'll get some more chip. See if I can get a rapid spin off or kill them. Might tear and tear ground here. Honestly, if I am tear ground, I can't even remember. Giga drain. Oh, of course. I should have just knocked him. I need to, like, do some major... All I do is breed. I don't know what to tell you guys. I breed, and then I try out the Pokemon, and I try to do a an OU, and then it's like I haven't played OU in so long, honestly. Yeah. Okay, well, let's at least go for... Should we try to Rapid Spin? They do have a Golden Go, but I'm going to be faster than them if they come out. I don't know how much it's going to do, but hopefully do a heck of a lot. Does not nearly enough. It's fine. So now one Mon's put to sleep, so they can't put my other Mon to sleep. Oh crap, but then they have freaking rocks up for my Sarah Ledge. So that freaking sucks, so I can't allow that to happen. Yeah, this battle is an embarrassment. I shouldn't even be doing this battle. I should be going to Publix or Walmart right now. Maybe I can at least knock him off that way I don't get more recovery. Okay. I'm going to U-turn out and try to get another turn of sleep off. Because I really need to rapid spin these rocks away. Otherwise, Sarah Ledge is dead. And I won't get to do what I want to do with it. Even though it's useless because they have an unaware Dondozo in the back. So really, I just got a hard counter team. I don't want to tell you folks. Yep, there's the Whirlwind. That's my strat in VGC. I imagine Whirlwind and doubles, it's crazy. Works out sometimes. Well, this is actually perfect. I'm a Hydra pump into the Amoongus. Oh, they stayed in cool. Almost got him. Ruination, it's fair. Alright, full switch into... Oh, nice. Perfect. Clean. You love to see it. Seems as though we're at an impasse. Nice. Excellent. I, I let them do more damage to me. They're really just going to, they want to sack this thing off. If you want to sack off your guy, that's fine by me. So at this point, they might go out into Dawn, who's probably Resto Chesto themselves. Alright, so I can just let myself die here. 
my Joy-Con finally turned back on. Alright, that's fair. They might be Specs. Don't really have much of a play here. Yeah, because they're just going to go Amoongus. So thankfully we got Sleep Claws on our side, but it's still not going to do a whole lot for me at this point. I got to bring up Point Break eventually. They're probably just going to foul play and kill me. I don't know what to tell you, gang. We built an awful team. I try to do it around Sarah Ledge, and I lose. That's just how it goes. That's the game we play. You're going to take a nice 25% and die to foul play. Oh, clear smog. Can I get the weakness policy? I mean, the uh, thing. Nope. Because it's a special move. Probably should have knocked in retrospect, but what are you going to do? Can anything switch into Bitter Blade? I mean, they have that. I might as well just SD. I've already lost. They can't put me to sleep. Oh, they're going to foul play me. I should have just bitter bladed my bad, folks. I was hoping they'd just switch out into Don Dozo. They're nice and they didn't foul play me. I'm looking like an absolute scrub at this point. Oh, hey, we took care of it. I'm surprised they just let me do that. I almost got my sash back. Maybe if I would have bitter bladed the first time, I could have gotten my sash back. Well, folks, that's what tilt does to you. That's what talking down to yourself does, I'm afraid. And the fact that they have a Don Dozo just chilling in the back doesn't help me a lot either. Yep, Sushi, Sushi Master themselves comes in. Um... If I can bitter blade them, then I can get back to HP and then maybe at least get a speed boost, even though that's not going to matter. But I can at least live, I'll at least get a little bit more off. Because now I can CC. Alright, perfect. So that'll do a bunch of chip to them. And so now we can close combat. Do a bunch of chip. Please don't rest up. Thank goodness. All right. Iron Blade can Thunderbolt. We're bringing this a lot closer than it would have been otherwise. They really they just let us take out three of their biggest walls, Ting Lu, Amoongus, and uh, Don Dozo. I thank you for the charity, my friend, for not uh, just sweeping me all out. This thing comes in, so um, they're probably going to be Terra Steel. So I'm going to close combat in anticipation of that. Because otherwise, no point in you. Okay, they were just going to let me moonblast them. 
thought they would Terra Steel. Okay. Fine by me. Oh, it didn't even kill. Were there weakness policy? Nope. Alright, that's okay. We weakened them successfully. Only problem is we only have these guys left. But if I can just wake up. But I think I might have a turn left. I'm not even sure if I burnt a single turn of sleep. Maybe I can live ahead. In close combat. Okay, we can live that. Who else do they have? Because after I beat this thing, can I knock off win at the end? No, because they still have that guy. Yeah, I just lose to Iron Valley in either way. It's okay. Still alive, just barely. And they haven't even used their Terra. And neither have I. We brought it a lot closer than it would have been. I'm probably going to stay asleep this turn, I imagine. Just thanking them for not 6 0 on me because this was an absolutely awful match. Uh, I need to honestly get another OU match near, but then it's good to redeem myself for this absolutely uh, awful match that I just played. I need to completely redesign the team around Sarah Ledge because this was awful. Worst battle I've played in a long time. It wasn't even that I played that bad. It was more so that I self-defeated myself with the team that just mono loses to Iron Valiant. Like seriously, not a single steel type. Even then, steel type would have saved me. What I really needed was like a good fairy or something. All right, it's gonna be GG's folks. I could have won for play rough, but I don't know. I kind of already self-defeated myself as soon as I saw I had no switches to Moonblast and I gave up. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe, and we'll see you guys in the next one. Hopefully I get another one to avenge myself for this godforsaken match, and we'll see you guys then. Alright people, we are here for the Serial Edge Redemption. Thankfully folks, we're still looking for battles. We got a battle against Purewell. Um, let me see. I tried to take a little bit more time to build this team, but I still don't know if it's going to turn out too well for us. Um, I think I might lead off with Grunkle Stan if they're going to lead the Dawn fan. And um, they do, of course, have the Zoro arc. They could also maybe lead that. So maybe actually I'll lead Hydreigon first. And then I got to open up the door for my cat. So I can lead that first. You turn out and then go out into something rather than risking wasting my booster and trying to get rocks up like I did the last time. Yeah, my bad. My team, it wasn't even that their team was super overwhelmingly powerful. It's just I had nothing for Iron Valiant except my own Iron Valiant who used up their own booster energy. And then didn't have anything for Moon so Just not very well rounded, unfortunately. But hopefully I can have better results. So if I want to say this is either Brute Bonnet or it's not. 
So that looks like it might be an actual Brute Bonnet. Or it could have also been a Zorark from the sky. It's kind of hard to tell. So I'm going to U-turn out. Let's find out if this is actually the thing it would appear to be. So... I don't have a Defogger. They're going to try to go for some stuff versus me. I could honestly try to calm mind up versus them. Because they can't taunt me. And I can waste the turns. They can't parting shot or anything versus me. They can set up their screens all they want, but if I get enough boost, I'll become unstoppable. I haven't really gotten to show off Latina hips at this point. That's the thing, every time I want to bring a, um... I don't like defogger, so I don't like the idea of removing my own hazards, but then it really opens me up to stuff like this. So that sucks. Oh, I forgot this thing can always lower my spatak. That sucks. But I can waste off out their screens, though. Get a little bit more spadef going. Perfect. If they send out Jack, I might have to Terra versus their King Gambit here. They didn't show Supreme Overlord, did they? Dang. But then again, I haven't killed anyone. So that probably... Does it not activate if it doesn't show? I don't think they are... So I'm going to go for... But if I Draining Kiss, I get more back. So I'll resist their hit right now. If they go for an Iron Head. And I can get some HP recovery going. So that does nothing to me cool. Alright, so we're chipping them down. Wasting out those light screen turns. Honestly, might have been better just to go out into the other thing, but... I don't know if I can afford to go for another Calm Mind. I need to see how much they do to me. Ooh, they go for the SD. That could be dangerous. Ultimately, they're not very strong at this point, though. And I do have my Bright Loom. I'll try to go for Mystical Fire. Please bone, don't be defiant. Ooh, weakness policy. Oh, nope, leftovers. Okay, perfect. Yeah, so the Supreme Overlord doesn't show unless somebody's died. Go for it one more time. Kill this thing. Oof. That's okay, though. We do have a Breloom. Literally one turn left. I should have calm minded on their SD. It's okay though.
Maybe I should have gone for a bullet punch. Nope, we made the right play. Perfect. Alright, so that thing goes down. There goes their light screen. If Grimson all comes back in, we can try to put him to sleep. But King Gambit being gone is excellent for my Sarah Ledge at the end. So the Dawn comes in, so I'm just gonna load a dice bullet seed real quick. Come on, press A. Hello? Oh, this is dangerous. My A button's not working. This ain't good. All right, well that sucked, I spammed A. All right, so that's a big unfortunate. So I spammed A trying to see if I get it to work. I guess I was gonna die there anyways. Um, so they're clearly the freaking thing. We'll go Ironium Treads. That freaking sucks. I don't know why my Joy-Cons aren't working right now. And I'm literally having to have my wireless controller all the way across the couch and stand up with my headphones, my wired headphones here. So we got the speed boost right, so I'm going to go for a knockoff versus something. Ooh, and their sash. Well, that sucks. That freaking sucks. So we'll probably die to this flamethrower, unfortunately. Ooh, we get it off, though. So we'll get rid of this thing. That's cool. I don't know why my... It literally... It's not even like sometimes where it starts connecting and stops. Maybe it died, but the green light was still on. So it doesn't make sense why my A button just stopped. No sense at all. Very unfortunate that I lost my Breloom. I think I'll take this opportunity to get up my rocks. So that at least, if they're gonna get up reflecting light screens, then I can get this off. No point in knocking them off right now, because they're just gonna... All right, we'll go for an EQ to try to get off a little bit more chip. It's unfortunate that we're gonna have to play with screens once again, but there's not much of a choice, but at least I got my rocks up. All too late, unfortunately. Does some good ship, I won't lie. We're wasting their turns. As many turns as we can waste, it's for the butter. I'll go on a spin cycle so they can't paralyze me. And maybe I'll just fire off a Hydro. It's fine. If I miss, that's not even better for me because it wastes more turns. Perfect. This is great. Excellent. The more turns I waste, the better. Alright, so we got speed and kill them, but that's some more turns. Excellent, it survived even better. So, let's see how many turns we got left. So, three more turns of reflect. I'll volt switch out here. Just trying to stall. I'll go Hydreigon because I'm Scarfed and I can U-turn out into anything I want to. They might just go Azu and try to set up and sweep. 
which could be a little scary, but I do have a Rotom. Yep, in comes Azu. They at least took some ship, they'll take a little bit more. I can will o -Wisp them, hopefully. Or maybe it's just better to Volt Switch out. I think burning them's probably for the best. I am a little low, which does suck, so I'm not sure if I can survive this. But if they go for player up, I outspeed them. Alright, perfect. So we'll put him on a timer. I don't know if this is going to save me, though. But it'll have to do. It's still plus six. Divided by two. Yep. Alright, perfect. Alright, this is my last shot. Sir, I let you gotta do it. So what are they? At least it'll give us a better indication. Are they Terra Normal? Alright, cool, they aren't. Perfect. Alright, perfect. They activate my Sash. It's gonna be close. Get the weak armor boost off. So now I'm plus two, plus two. I just have to hope that with the burn, this should kill, but I'm not certain. Oh, my cat is so close to making me choke by getting at the wire. Perfect. So Azu goes down. The only thing is the um their darn uh, brute bonnet probably has sucker. So I don't know if it's better. They go trunks actually. Alright, so I can go for bitter blade, get some recovery, do as much damage as I can, and then hopefully Hydreigon can finish it. I'm plus two, it should do a good chunk. I'll probably still die, of course, but it's in range where hopefully Flamethrower Hydreigon can win. Alright, come on, buddy, I need you to do it for me. Trunks goes down. Like hopefully Brute Bonnet can't touch me. I think it does get close combat though. So it'll be close, like I said. Oof, are they gonna CC me? Ooh, they go for the Spore. That sucks too. The Spore always gets me, but it's a lot closer, you know what? At the end of the day, the A button not working on my Joy-Con really sucked. But I was probably going to go for Seed Bomb either way. <laughs> Looking back, they shouldn't have brought a Dawn. I should have questioned why they brought a Dawn fan in versus me. Go for Payback. Okay, so I guess they can't touch me? Question mark. If I can wake up right now, I can win. Come on, Hydreigon, wake up. 
I think I can, I can take one more turn. Come on, buddy, wake up, wake up, wake up. I think either way, I'll 2 KO because they have to keep going for paybacks versus me. Yes, let's go. Come on, do it. Oh, please don't go for Spore. All right. Oh, wait, but then the payback's going to do more. Oh, I, I guess not. I guess because I'm already faster than them, that's the max it can do. Because I was going to say it was doing a heck of a lot. All right, well, thankfully they didn't crit me. Ooh, but the sucker! Oh, I told they had sucker. I don't know why they didn't go into that earlier. But that was a lot better game. I like that. Sarah Ledge Guy has Redemption. At the end of the day, I should have known that that was not the Dawn fan and it was a Zorark, but I was too preoccupied. That's going to be GG, folks. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe, and we'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.